Howdy, Bard. It's a little cold out here today. <laughs> and I left my gloves inside, but I had to go get the, ca uh, the camera and come out. And as, if you saw my video last night, you know, it hasn't been a real good week, and we lost we lost a heifer this week. But I wanted to share this with you. Our luck's turned around, and I want to share you the new offering from the ranch. Let me just uh, do that right now. All right, Tara. You clean clean them up. Yeah. I think we gotta give her a little room and let her do her thing, guys. <laughs> First steps. First time up. Look at that. Mama's trying to clean her up. She kind of picked a crappy spot to drop that calf. <laughs> you could have you could have gone 20 feet over and gotten some grass, you know. Hello, Goldilocks. Well, as is life, it's a struggle to stay up. Yeah, it got me spooked a little. That was. Yeah, I'm obviously creating problems for her. We'll let them do their thing. There you go, guys. The week's gotten better. <laughs> yeah, there isn't even any coffee. Well, there you go. New calf. Yeah. Today's a good day. Things are turning around. I'll give her a few minutes out there to clean her up and uh, eat her sack. <laughs> I don't want to push them too fast. It's 20 degrees out there, plenty warm enough for a Highland calf. We'll uh, go back out there in a little bit and see how she's doing. Maybe take a towel and help get some of the stuff off her if she's not cleaned up yet. And uh, try to get her into one of the small pens with uh, a roof on it for the night. Throw down some sawdust. That's about all she'll need if that. A pretty hardy breed. They do find just on their own, but it is supposed to get negative six tonight. Down to negative six, so. But right now, the sun may come out, or may not. It might come out. If it does, then they'll be fine. Probably don't even have to do that. But we'll see. I'll go check on them a little later. Thought you might enjoy seeing that. That's the first one. First calf of this, of 2017 here at the ranch. Yeah, there we go. First calf of the year. Thought I'd share that with you. And, of course, it came out of Tara, who's only had one calf before. She's, I don't know, four years old, a little three and a half, four years old. I think four. Yeah, she's four years old. 
And her first offspring was named Trigger because she was a, a, just a palomino colored calf. And this one looks like it'll be the same. White face and a palomino col color. We, of course, we cross them with a, a Hereford. So they, they, they've been coming up pretty much with white faces. I would say 80 plus percent of the time they drop with a white face. So there you go. Yeah, you see, life's not so bad. Eventually your, your luck turns <laughs> and things are all right. Thanks for tuning in, guys. If you like my channel, please subscribe. Before I go, I'm going to give you a reason to subscribe. I'm having a contest right now on my channel where when I get to 5,000 subs, I'm giving away a $350 gift certificate to Brownells. And all you got to do today to get in my 5,000 sub giveaway is, number one, you got to be a subscriber. Yeah, you got a subscriber. How do I get to 5,000 subs? Number two, like this video. And number three, in the comment section down below, just type in what you think we should name this calf. It's got to start with a T. Yeah, the name's got to got to start with a T. Tara's the heifer, the last offspring. We named it Trigger, and we're going to have to pick a name for this one. Thanks for tuning in, guys. If you like my channel, please subscribe. Till next time, go out there and stay safe.